I'd like to introduce Tim Watson from the representative from the Ohio ETD Association. They are the first ETD association in the nation, and that gave rise to ultimately the U.S. ETD. Thank you, John. Good afternoon, everyone. As John said, I'm Tim Watson, the Director of Graduation Services in the Graduate School at the Ohio State University, and I'm certainly happy to join you all for the day. However, I'm also addressing you today on behalf of the 30 plus member institutions from the state of Ohio that are part of the Ohio Link ETD Consortium, and as well as their members of the Ohio Electronic Thesis and Dissertation Association. On behalf of the Ohio ETD member institutions, it is a pleasure to welcome you to the 2020 US ETDA virtual town hall meeting. Our Ohio Consortium is delighted to be able to help sponsor this event and like you, look forward to hearing from the many presenters during today's sessions. It is hard to believe that many universities and colleges in the state of Ohio have now been processing ETDs for almost 20 years, but we feel privileged to continue on the journey of expanding the ETD field and discussing the opportunities for the future with all of you. We are lucky in this state that we have a wonderful partner for the submission and preservations of our ETDs, which is the Ohio Library and Information Network known as Ohio Link. Ohio Link has been pivotal in putting Ohio universities and schools at the forefront of ETD development and have been a forward thinking partner that has helped us evolve through the changing ETD landscape over the past two decades. Ohio member institutions work with Ohio Link through the Ohio Link ETD Council, an eight member committee of both library and graduate school staff that meets quarterly to discuss ETD trends that impact our members as well as working with the Ohio Link liaison to continually evaluate and improve the ETD center which is where the submission and the repository system is for our member institutions. In October of 2019, the Ohio Link ETD Center reached some amazing milestones, 100,000 open access ETD submissions, 85 million downloads coming from 234 countries. We think this is certainly reflective of the health of the ETD field overall and take some measure of pride in being part of the ever-growing impact on how students develop their thesis or dissertation and then share their hard work with the rest of the world. As COVID has impacted all of our lives, it was unfortunate that the 2020 uh, US ETDA conference in Cleveland needed to be postponed. But of course, here in Ohio, we are thrilled that the decision was made to make Cleveland, Ohio, the US ETDA conference destination for 2021. We are excited to be a sponsor for that event as well and look forward to working with the US ETDA board and making Cleveland the place to be uh, in 2021 for ETD professionals. The best part of these groups, and we kind of mentioned this here just a little bit, is, is the camaraderie and the sharing of ideas that, uh, and, and shared experiences that we've had. Uh, that has always been the best part of, of any of these ETD uh, conferences or seminars that I've ever attended. Uh, and they've really been some of the most rewarding of my 20 year graduate career, uh, graduate school career. I've uh, just always enjoyed working with the ETD folks tremendously. So we look forward to seeing you in Cleveland in 2021 and greeting you hopefully in person at that point. But of course, for today, we are extremely excited to have uh, this wonderful town hall meeting. And we thank the US ETDA organizers and the board for putting this together and for continuing the positive relationships uh, that we can enjoy here in the present. So thanks so much for the opportunity and I hope you enjoy the rest of the day. Great, thank you so much, Tim.